Welcome to Storm Riders Wheels with your host, Master Lou. Welcome back to Storm Riders Wheels, it's Luke here. I'll be showing you my duplicate cars and all of their details and showing you some close-ups at the end of the video. And I'll also be showing you how to open the packages without hurting the cars from the package. So let's get straight into it. So this first car is called the El Vento. So this is gonna, uh, this is how you open it without hurting it. You just go from the bottom or the top, whichever side you wanna do, that you want the least detail on, you just peel but you don't peel all the way up. So you peel until you get here. Then you poke the little hole. There we go. So now it's open. You just slide your finger across, and boom, you got it out. So the package is still good. Put the card back in there when you want. The car. Detail that is. Just the hood itself is detailed to that front window right there. All like the cyborg y stuff. Back has like two engines or something. It's like engines. Wait, it says lift. That is awesome! It's convertible. So you can take off the top and put it back on. So it probably says it on the package. It does. That's awesome. So you can lift that off, put it back on both sides. There you go. That's awesome. So I think we're gonna move on to the next car. This next car is called the Rocket Box. There you go. So again, you just wanna peel from one of the corners. Doesn't matter which one. If it does that, you might wanna go from the other corner. It might work a little bit better, which in this case it didn't. Okay, okay, cut, cut. All right, this is Luke's dad, and I think I'm gonna step in here real quick. Clear that table off, buddy. You gotta clear that table off. I got an early birthday present for you. And I know you weren't expecting this, but I think you're gonna like what it is. L2593. 72 cars! 372 assortment. What case is this? Probably Three. case L. Case L. Let's see. Um. I want to be careful not to hurt any of the cars inside. This is awesome. I can't believe my dad just got this for me. I've been wanting one of these for like weeks now. So let's go ahead and get this open. I just can't wait. I've been seeing uh, people on uh, YouTube doing this and like a uh, hot uh, die cast garage. I like him a lot, but um, I love uh, watching those type of videos. This is awesome. So let's get straight into it. So, has a case full of cars. Okay, let's look at the first three cars. So here we go. Here's the first three. The first one is Bad Matter 2. Second one is the Honda Racer. The third one is the Gazella GT. So, I think I actually have this car in red. Really cool find. I am actually trying to finish this set right here. Don't have many of this set. This set too. Don't have many of this set either. And this set, also trying to finish. So let's go on to the next three. Looks like we already have a double. 
the the winning formula. It kind of looks like this Honda Racer that we just got. There we go. It's a purple car. It's like a dragster. Two of them. It's from the game circuit. Uh, no, digital circuit set. Next is the battery one set series. Whoops, wrong way. It's a Tesla Model S. HW Green Speed. So we're going to move on to the next three. Another one of the trucks off duty. I actually have one of these in the Rescue series. That's really cool to get. Go to the next one. Ooh, it's another um, Tesla Model X. It's a really nice car to get two of. I want to open one. Next up is the Chill Mill. It's a little bit dense in the bottom, but that's all fine. On to the next one. The So Plode is a. I actually have a red car of this same exact uh, model from the Snowstormers. That. That means it's from the uh, F box because it has an F right there and my dad knows that this is either from the F or the P. I think that means it's from the F. So we're going to go ahead and move on to the next one. This one is the Teague Ray. It's a green, nice looking car. I'm not for sure if I have this one. This might be the one I need. Hold on, let me see. One out of ten? Yes. I'm pretty sure this is one I needed. Here's the card up and down. It's the best for track. Here's the back. There you go. We're going to move on to the next car. It's the same car, the Treadway. Right. So we're going to be opening this one. It says best for track. We're going to be testing that. Soon, on a different video, we're going to be opening it. Back. There you go. It's a grass chomper. It's like a lawnmower. It's a really nice car. It says new for 2016. So this is a 2016 box. It's yellow. Best for track. We're going to be testing that if we get another one. So this is from the Ride-On series. Right there. I don't have too many Ride-Ons. But, so we're going to go to the next one. This next one is called the Voltage Spike. New for 2016. Two of them. There we go. That's really nice. And not all of these cars are from are new for, for 2016 though. Oh, nice. Two of the M Roller. That is sick. It is from the HW Showroom series. New for 2016. So that. I will definitely be opening one of these. It says best for track on it. We'll be testing that out. There we go. On to the next car. Ooh, we have another one. So I'll probably be selling one of these. I have to determine which one I'm going to be selling. But I'll probably be selling one of these in like one of the next videos. So here we go. On to the next one, Power Surge. It's from the Green Speed series on to the next it's the bmw 14 from the bmw series nice red this is not new for 2016 there you 
go. On to the next one. This is the 70s Ford Escort. RST600. This is also a really nice car that I really like. So let's move on to the next one. Here's the back. It's from the Speed Graphics series. Uh, on these ones, it seemed like the factory didn't place them in the box good and they bent the cards. They definitely have some we're going to be opening. That one down there is probably the worst. But we're going to go through them anyways. This one's from the Speed Graphics. It's the Porsche 954 Turbo RSR. It's a gray with blue interior. Or blue windows, sorry. Blue top and hood. So we're gonna move on to the next one. This next one is the Bad Matter 2. Mutter 2, sorry. Good thing we have two of those. We'll be opening this one up on one of the upcoming videos. Since the card's bent on this one, both the edges, we're gonna be opening this one. So here we go, here's another set of two. 96 Nissan 180. SX Type X, really nice. White with gray on the side. Toyo trees on it. So we're gonna go to the next third. This one I do have it in red from the HW Race or not Res Race Rescue series. It's the back. This is a green type. Make sure it's not anything special. So, I'm gonna move on. This next car is the two timer. From the Super Chromes. 22 right there. Orange, or red inside. Red on the top with silver silver chrome on the rest of the body. Ooh, another chill mill. Another really cool car. It's from the HW City Works series. So there you go. On to the next. This next one is the 2017 Ford F1 50 Raptor. It's the four by four. It's number 10 out of 10 in the set. Here's the back. And the Hot Wheels Hot Trucks. Next car is the thir 2013 Chevrolet Co Copo. It says Fram on the side from the Speed Legend or Speed Graphics. Hot Wheels Speed Graphics. Red or I mean orange stripe on the top and on the sides. Next up is the McLaren P1. It has a little indention on the side that is black, black front, black windows, tinted windows. White on the side, I think. And blue car, black body, or back, black rear. So we're gonna move on to the next one. This next one is sweet. It's the Dodge Challenger drift car. I have a couple Dodge Challengers, but this one's probably the uh, coolest one of all. It is purple. Here's the back. There we go. with yellow stripes. A lot of detail on this one. This is Dodge right there on the side. So we're gonna move on to the next. It's, this one is in the Street Beast set two. It's a Dragon Blaster. So I have a blue of this car too, 
This one is in the Dino Riders. So we're gonna move on to the next. That was a really nice car too. Next up is the Bulletproof car. Five out of 10 on the X Racers. I think I might have need this car too. This might be the car that I have it in red though. I'm not for sure. Best on track. Kinda looks like a Mustang to me. Tell me what you think. Yellow wheels, orange glass, blue body. Just the back. There we go. Next up is the Jet Threat 4.0. Seems like this one has been opened. So, oh wait, there's two of them. That was nice, that's nice. It's from the Sky Show. I don't have any of these, so it's nice to get these. I'm probably gonna go ahead and open this since it's basically already open. So I'm gonna set that one to the side and go ahead and open this. It looks like it's been opened really cleanly. Ooh, that's cool. It opens like that, so it flies. There you go. Here's the box. It doesn't say any moving parts on it, but definitely does. It doesn't seem like anything else moves, but there you go. Another one from the Dino riders so next up oh this one's really cool it's the mountain molar tell me in the comments if this is an error it being sideways ish i'm not for sure it's from the daredevils i am almost finished with that set i just need a couple more here's the back there you go Okay, here's some rare ones right here. This HW screen time set is super hard to find. I only have two of the set. This is my, it would be my third one. And there's two in this. That is awesome. I'm definitely gonna be opening one of these. Actually, I might keep both of them closed, but that's really sick. Snoopy. from the Peanut series. Another one of the back drafters from the HW Rescue. So I can't open this. I have a collection of fire trucks. This will be really good in that collection. So we're gonna move on to this 76 Greenwood Chevrolet. It's HW Wild to Mild. I do not have any of this set. This will be my first car. Two of them too. That is awesome. There we go. 68. Okay, so we're gonna move on. Whoa. Three of them. Three 67 Chevy C-10s in the HW Hot Trucks. That is awesome. So I'll definitely be selling one of these and I'll be keeping one inside the package, keeping one outside. So we're gonna go ahead and move on. Next up is another ride-on. Same one as the other one, the Grass Chomper. But this is an awesome one to get because you can actually put Lego figures inside of these. And any other figures you want to put in them, not just Lego. So here you go. Here's the back. We're going to move on since we already talked about that one. Oh, this one's a really cool car. It's a custom 64 Volkswagen Squareback from the Art Cars series. 
It has a ton of different colors. It's different from the color on the um, card. The color on the card is like a little bit darker, but it's still a really cool looking car. I love that blue turquoise. Purple. There you go. So we're gonna move on. Ooh, this is awesome. 67 Chevrolet SS396. It says on the back, Congra congratulations, you just made a rare find. This 67 che Chevrolet SS396 with its exclusive deco celebrates the leap year with epic style. So this is a rare car. That is awesome. I don't have that many rare cars in my uh, collection. So this is an awesome car to add. 29 on the side. I'm probably going to be keeping both of these in the package since they're um, rare. There you go. So we're going to move on. I'm going to put these in a safe place since they're rare. Here's the note. So I'm going to set these to the side so I don't mess them up. So here's another car. It's a grass chopper again. Same color and everything. So I'm going to be selling this car. If you have this car, tell me in the comments below. If you don't have this car and you're looking to get this car, tell me in the comments too. I could uh, figure out something to arrange a trade or uh, tell you the prices. Oh, this is not really nice car. I have this car in a different color. It's actually a cream color, the one I have. This one's a red color, or a pinkish color. It's an art car. Two of these, so I'm gonna be opening one of these up. There's the front, there's the back. Blue top, H. And I'm not for sure, but I'm either it tells you the whole alphabet whenever you get the whole set, or a word. I was thinking about that yesterday whenever I was going through all my Hot Wheels and I saw these. And tell me if that's true in the comments. So there you go. Move on. Ooh, a Batman car. Ooh, that's nice. Black car with red rims. It's the Dark Knight Batmobile. That is really sick red windows i do not have this color which is crazy there you go three out of five i know that there's a three out of five that's rare i don't think this one's it, it might be actually i have to check that and on the back it says help ba map help batman fight crime and protect gotham city in these batmobile inspired vehicles so there's the back there's the words if you want to pause it and read that yourself. That's a really nice find. So, next up. Ooh, another X Racer. It's a Faradox. I do not have this color, at least from what I remember. I'm pretty sure it's like blue or something like that. This is like a red, red yellow, and green. Or is that just, oh, that's a metallic with, um, that yellow makes it look green on the video. With red wheels. Really nice car. So, next up, we have two custom 2001 Acura Integra GSR. It's from the Nightburner set. Really nice yellow. Has a ton of detail on the back. There go. On the license plate, it says Hot Wheels. That really small logo. Ooh, two more. So plowed again. Another double. Probably be opening this too. Really nice car. Just the 
back says on the back it says chill out and ready to take on the power so here's another car this one's another one that's pretty bent this is one that i probably want a double of from the spectator one of or zero zero seven right there the seven makes like a gun look there you go from the showroom series i really want a double of these there we go next up This is a car that I'm collecting. I have four of it. It's the Fig Rig HW Ride-Ons. I'm hoping I get a double of this one too because I want to open it and put it with my other four. I know there's a lot more colors, so I hope I have more, but this one's silver with red and yellow. And there's two studs in the back where a little minifigure could fit. And then two studs on the front where a Lego minifigure could go it's from the Ride On series. There you go. Best on track. Next up is another one of the Dodge Charger drift cars. Same color and everything. I'll be opening this one up. I think this might be the third, it might be the second though. Um, I will be selling this if it's the third one from the Speed Graphics. Purple. Next up, 69 Ford Toronto Taladega from the Speed Graphics. There we go. There's the back. It says real race performers that spe speed fast on track. And it's funny because it's not even a best for track. But here's another two Honda racers. So I'll be selling one of these and opening one. There you go. Next up is a Lamborghini Urus. I didn't know Lamborghini made cars like this. There you go. From the Hot Truck series. Next up, from the HW Mild to Wild, Aston Martin Vintage GT3. Nice car to get. Has the fin on the back. The Mild is blue, Wild is red. It's a really nice car, a really detailed car. There we go. Next up, X Racer Speed Slayer. Do you have this one? I will be opening this one up on an upcoming video. It has jets on the back. Here's the back of the card. Let me move some of these so they don't fall. I don't want to mess up any of the cars we see in this video. Next up is the Porsche Croata GT. It's from the Exotics series. There you go. Black. Really nice looking. Okay. Wow, another set of three. That is awesome. It's a custom 72 Chevy Love. 
So I'll be selling one, keeping one inside the package, and one to open, to be in my open car collection. So these are the custom center to Chevy Loves from the Hot Trucks series. Here's the back. A red truck with a huge motor at the front. Black line with two lines beside it. Yellow and white. New for 2016. It actually says on the back, born 1972, birthplace, Detroit, Michigan, USA, designer, General Motors. And it also says, especially love stands for light utility vehicle. And this souped up, decked out version features all exposed engine, sunroof, and plenty of power. Man, that's 72 cars that I just went through. That's crazy. So that's it for this video. Big shout outs to my dad. The whole reason for this video was to look through cars and unbox them. My dad come yelling, cut, cut, cut. I forgot all about the original video. So let's get back to that. Okay, so it looks like we left off on the rocket box. It's a little bit open. So let's see if I can get this opened any further. There we go. So now it's open. Just gonna take that a little bit more. So I can get this all the way open. Then you just slide your finger across. Then you can open it just like that. There we go. The rocket box is really big. This one was a little bit harder to get out, so it wasn't as clean as this one. But it's still nice to have the card still pretty much intact. It's a little bit of like a chubbier car, letter T on top. It's like palm sized. Purple wheel in the back, orange wheel in the front. Same on both sides. Rolls pretty well. There you go. So I think we're gonna go ahead and move on to the next car. This next car is the Rally Cat. It's from the digital circuit. So this is the Rally Cat. This is the blue one, not the red one. Really nice car. It says it's a track star. So we're gonna move on to this Ford Focus RS. So I'm gonna try to open it from the bottom this time. There we go. That's a Ford Focus. Normal windshield with red interior. Red lines on the wheels. This one was a little bit easier to open. Black instead of uh, white. There's also a white version. This one seems like it's gonna open really well. There we go. Here we go. This one is the Honda Civic Type R. It's a white car. My mom and my grandpa have Honda Civics. They're not the Type R though. My sister was actually looking at a Type R to buy it, but uh, that the same exact day I bought this and she didn't, I didn't know that she was uh, looking to buy it or um, she didn't know that I was uh, getting this. It was a really cool uh, coincidence. There you go. So we're gonna move on. One of my favorite cars. This one's the Baja Bone Shaker. My favorite car is the normal Bone Shaker, but the Baja Bone Shaker is the same kind of like brand type thing of the Bone Shaker. It's just a little bit different. This one was the one that I was most excited to open. This is a blue Baja Bone Shaker. But really nice car. Has a lot of detail, including a extra tire on the back. 
It's funny how it's blue and all the other wheels are just black. They didn't add that extra piece of detail. It has the engine sticking out the top, the normal bone skull on the front with the fingers and then the bones as the exhaust too, both sides. So we're gonna go ahead and move on to this pile driver. Let's see. Man, this one opened up opened up really well. Look at that. Look how clean that opened. Barely even tell it was open. There we go. Let's see if this spins well. Felt really cheap since it's to totally made out of plastic, but it spins really well. There you go. Red interior, red engine, yellow car, black wheels, black bottom, black roll cage. Actually, I think in the bottom is actually metal. It feels a little bit colder than plastic. So we move on to the Drifsta. We actually have two of these cars. Man, they really opened up really well this time. Two of these cars. I'm gonna go ahead and get out the other drift stuff. This one too. I had two of both of the colors. That's crazy. That one opened up really well too. Whoops. There we go. This one feels a little bit heavier than this one. And this one feels a little bit more well um, built. <laughs> hmm, what's that noise? Hmm. There you go. The gray and the red. So that seems almost it for this video we have one more left it's the blitzer right, let me try to open this okay get out the blitzer it's a really nice chrome car from the super chrome series orange wheels red bottom silver top orange glass black interior really nice car this one opened up really well too i guess i just got better at opening them after opening a couple there you go so that's it for this video i hope you enjoyed big shout out to my dad for buying me that 72 set that was a huge surprise i was speechless whenever i saw it i knew what it was but i was just so speechless so I hope you will come back and see us again. Like, subscribe, and ring that bell so you won't miss any upcoming videos. Bye. Thank you for watching Storm Riders Wheels. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell. So you got a rare car leap, that leap year. Yeah, that's amazing. Two of them. Two of them. <laughs>